Embark on a thrilling interstellar adventure with Andy Weir's Project Hail Mary, a captivating novel that seamlessly combines scientific wonder, gripping storytelling, and a touch of wit. Within the pages of this extraordinary masterpiece, readers are transported to a future where the destiny of humanity hangs in the balance, igniting a desire to devour the entire narrative. As the book unfolds, it becomes apparent that Project Hail Mary is ingeniously divided into five distinct parts, each meticulously crafted to build upon the previous one. From the intriguing prologue, which plunges readers into a dying earth teetering on the brink of disaster, to the heart-stopping epilogue that offers a glimpse into the aftermath of the mission, where masterfully guides us through a meticulously structured and enthralling journey. With his trademark precision and scientific expertise, Weir takes complex concepts and makes them accessible, allowing readers to immerse themselves in a richly imagined world. Every chapter is infused with a sense of wonder, weaving intricate scientific principles seamlessly into the fabric of the narrative. As the story unfolds across the five parts, the pace intensifies, leaving readers eagerly turning the pages to uncover the next twist and revelation. In Project Hail Mary, where showcases his ability to create relatable and memorable characters. The protagonist, Ryland Grace, leads a diverse cast of individuals, each with their own unique strengths and vulnerabilities. As the story progresses, readers become emotionally invested in their triumphs, failures, and personal growth, forging a deep connection that keeps them engaged until the final page. The narrative is not simply a thrilling space adventure it also delves into profound themes and ethical dilemmas. Weir prompts readers to contemplate the consequences of humanity's actions, the power of collaboration and empathy, and the fragility of our planet. Through the meticulously crafted parts, the story offers a tapestry of ideas that challenge readers to consider their own roles in shaping the future. Project Hail Mary is a masterclass in storytelling, blending scientific authenticity with heart-pounding suspense. As readers journey through the five intricately woven parts, they are drawn deeper into a world of infinite possibilities. With each turn of the page, the desire to uncover the fate of humanity in the resolution of Ryland Grace's journey becomes an irresistible force, compelling readers to devour every word until the final, satisfying conclusion. Prologue A Dying Earth the prologue of Project Hail Mary sets the stage for the gripping and urgent narrative that follows. It paints a bleak picture of Earth's dire circumstances and introduces the looming threat that drives the mission at the heart of the story. As the prologue unfolds, we witness a dying Earth on the brink of collapse. The planet's ecosystems are in disarray, with rampant climate change, dwindling resources, and a desperate struggle for survival. The consequences of humanity's actions have caught up with them, and now they face the ultimate catastrophe, a dimming sunday. The sun, our life-giving star, is undergoing a devastating transformation. A previously unknown cosmic phenomenon called the astrophage has emerged, slowly devouring the sun's energy and causing it to dim. This decline in solar power has severe repercussions for life on Earth, as photosynthesis dwindles, temperatures drop, and ecosystems crumble. Amidst this desperate situation, scientists, politicians, and global leaders scramble to find a solution. International collaboration becomes paramount as governments set aside their differences and unite under the banner of Project Hail Mary. The mission's goal is to explore the depths of space and find a way to neutralize the astrophage, saving humanity from imminent extinction. The prologue introduces key characters who will play pivotal roles in the story. Among them is Ryland Grace, a high school science teacher with a unique background in microbial life and astrophysics. Little do we know at this point that Ryland will become the linchpin of the Hail Mary mission, entrusted with the fate of humanity. The prologue also provides glimpses of the immense challenges faced by the mission scientists. They grapple with the enigmatic nature of the astrophage, struggling to comprehend its behavior, replication patterns, and potential weaknesses. The scientific community is filled with a sense of urgency, 
knowing that time is running out and the window of opportunity for Earth's survival is rapidly closing. Throughout the prologue, the narrative expertly captures the desperation, fear, and determination that permeates society. It paints a vivid picture of a world on the edge of oblivion, where humanity's last hope rests on the success of the Hail Mary mission. By the end of the prologue, readers are primed for the epic journey that lies ahead. They are captivated by the enormity of the task at hand, the intricacies of the astrophage threat, and the potential for scientific discovery and human resilience in the face of overwhelming odds. The prologue serves as a powerful introduction to Project Hail Mary, setting the tone for a high-stakes, thought-provoking adventure that explores the boundaries of science, humanity, and the inherent will to survive. Andy Weir's expert storytelling hooks readers from the outset, immersing them in a world teetering on the edge of extinction and leaving them eager to uncover the mysteries that lie beyond. Part 1, Who I Am In Part 1 of Project Hail Mary, we are introduced to the protagonist, Ryland Grace, as he awakens aboard the Hail Mary spacecraft with no memory of who he is or why he is there. Confusion and disorientation cloud his mind as he tries to piece together his identity and purpose. As Ryland explores the ship, he discovers that he is not alone. There are two deceased crewmates, Commander Jenkins and Dr. Bankol, whose corpses provide little insight into what happened. Ryland finds a computer system named Rocky, an artificial intelligence that assists him in navigating the ship and regaining his memories. With Rocky's help, Ryland accesses the ship's logs and begins to unravel the mystery of their mission. He discovers that Earth is in grave danger due to a devastating cosmic threat known as the Astrophage. This alien microorganism is consuming the sun's energy, causing it to dim and leading to the gradual extinction of life on Earth. Ryland learns that the Hail Mary was sent to the Tau Ceti star system to find a solution to neutralize the astrophage and save humanity. Ryland's expertise as a high school science teacher and his background in microbial life and astrophysics make him a crucial member of the mission. As he delves deeper into the ship's records and his own memories, he begins to regain his scientific knowledge and skills, which proves vital in understanding the nature of the astrophage. The memories that resurface for Ryland are not only related to his professional life but also his personal experiences. He recalls his interactions with his former colleague, Eva Stratt, a brilliant scientist who played a significant role in the mission's planning. Their relationship is complicated, with a mix of professional respect, personal connection, and unresolved tensions. Through his memories, Ryland also reminisces about his mentor, Dr. Shara Kapoor, whose guidance and teachings shaped his scientific career. Dr. Kapoor's brilliant mind and unwavering dedication to research have left a lasting impact on Ryland's life. As Ryland dives deeper into his memories and studies the astrophage, he realizes that these alien microorganisms are not intentionally malevolent. They are simply following their natural instincts to consume energy for survival and reproduction. However, their exponential growth poses an existential threat to life on Earth. With Rocky's assistance, Ryland formulates theories and experiments to understand the behavior and vulnerabilities of the astrophage. He conducts simulations, analyzes data, and explores possible solutions to counteract their destructive effects on the sun. Part 1 concludes with Ryland's growing sense of responsibility and determination to fulfill his mission. He understands the urgency of finding a solution and saving humanity from impending doom. Armed with his regained knowledge and the partnership with Rocky, Ryland prepares to face the challenges that lie ahead and embark on a journey of discovery, both within himself and in the vastness of space. Part 1 sets the stage for the epic scientific quest that Ryland Grace must undertake, as he not only fights against the ticking clock of Earth's survival but also grapples with his own identity and purpose. Andy Weir's meticulous attention to scientific detail, combined with Ryland's personal journey of self-discovery, sets the foundation for a gripping and thought-provoking science fiction adventure in Project Hail Mary. Part 2, What's Going On? 
In part two of Project Hail Mary, titled What's Going On, Ryland Grace delves deeper into his mission to understand the nature of the astrophage and find a solution to save Earth from its devastating effects. With Rocky's assistance, Ryland studies the behavior and characteristics of the astrophage. He conducts experiments in controlled environments aboard the Hail Mary and analyzes the data to unravel the secrets behind their rapid replication and energy consumption. He realizes that the key to finding a solution lies in understanding the underlying mechanisms of the astrophage's biology and their interaction with solar energy. Ryland's scientific journey takes him to the forefront of astrophysics and microbiology. He revisits his extensive knowledge and pushes the boundaries of his understanding, determined to unlock the mysteries of the alien microorganisms. He explores various scientific disciplines, from studying microbial ecosystems to delving into the physics of energy transfer and conversion. As Ryland progresses in his research, he discovers that the astrophage has an intricate structure, resembling a complex web of interconnected organisms. Each organism has a unique role in the energy consumption and replication process. This discovery prompts him to develop new theories and hypotheses, which he rigorously tests through simulations and experiments. Ryland's collaboration with Rocky becomes increasingly crucial as they work together to analyze the massive amounts of data generated by their experiments. Rocky's advanced computational abilities and artificial intelligence provide valuable insights and assist Ryland in making breakthroughs in his understanding of the astrophage. Throughout this exploration, Ryland realizes that the astrophage is not intentionally malevolent. They are simply a product of evolution, driven by their need to survive and propagate. However, their exponential growth and voracious energy consumption threaten to extinguish all life on Earth. Ryland also grapples with the ethical implications of his mission. He questions whether it is justified to seek the annihilation of an alien species for the sake of saving humanity. These moral dilemmas weigh heavily on him as he struggles to reconcile the potential loss of one life form against the preservation of another. As Ryland's knowledge deepens, he begins to formulate potential solutions to neutralize the astrophage. He explores the possibility of disrupting their energy absorption mechanism or altering their replication process. He conducts simulations and tests these ideas, evaluating their feasibility and potential consequences. The challenges and setbacks Ryland faces in his research further highlight the urgency of finding a solution. The sun continues to dim, and the Earth's ecosystems suffer from the lack of solar energy. The countdown to humanity's extinction looms ever closer. Part 2 concludes with Ryland on the brink of a breakthrough. His relentless pursuit of knowledge and understanding brings him closer to unraveling the secrets of the astrophage. Armed with new theories, experimental data, and rocky support, he prepares to embark on the next phase of his mission, a daring exploration of alien technology and the search for answers beyond the boundaries of the Hail Mary. Part 2 explores the intricate science behind the astrophage and the challenges faced by Ryland Grace as he races against time to find a solution. Andy Weir skillfully combines scientific concepts, intellectual curiosity, and ethical dilemmas to create a gripping narrative that keeps readers engaged and pondering the complex nature of humanity's struggle for survival. Part 3, The Way Things Are In Part 3 of Project Hail Mary, titled The Way Things Are, Ryland Grace embarks on a new phase of his mission to explore the alien spacecraft near Tau Ceti, unravel the secrets of the Iridians, and find a solution to save Earth from the devastating astrophage. Guided by the clues left behind by the Iridians, Ryland and Rocky devise a plan to investigate the dormant alien species and their advanced technology. With their newfound understanding of the astrophage and the Iridians' failed attempts to combat it, they set their sights on uncovering a solution hidden within the vastness of the universe. Equipped with a specially designed spacesuit and the necessary equipment, Ryland ventures outside the Hail Mary into the alien spacecraft. The spacecraft is a marvel of technology, filled with intricate 
artifact systems and structures that reflect the advanced knowledge of the Iridians. As he explores, Ryland marvels at the ingenuity of this ancient civilization and seeks to decipher their purpose and methodology. Ryland discovers that the Iridians had sent out ships like the Hail Mary to various star systems, searching for a way to combat the astrophage. The dormant Iridians on board the ship hold invaluable information that could potentially provide the key to Earth's salvation. Through meticulous examination and collaboration with Rocky, Ryland begins to decipher the Iridians' language and decode their records. He learns about their experiments, their struggles against the astrophage, and the characteristics of the planet KELT 22b, an immense gas giant with an extraordinary composition. The Iridians had attempted to harness the power of KELT 22b to counteract the astrophage. They discovered that the planet's unique properties could be manipulated to generate a massive burst of energy capable of neutralizing the alien microorganisms. Ryland realizes that the Iridians' plan involved using KELT 22b as a weapon against the astrophage, but their efforts fell short, leaving the solution incomplete. Driven by his determination to save Earth, Ryland focuses his efforts on understanding the Iridian's technology and the intricacies of manipulating KELT 22b. He conducts simulations and experiments to replicate the Iridian's methods, refining their techniques in the hopes of successfully utilizing the gas giant as a defense against the astrophage. During this phase of his mission, Ryland also reflects on the sacrifices made by his fellow crew members, Commander Jenkins and Dr. Bankol. He mourns their loss and honors their memory, recognizing their invaluable contributions to the mission and the dire consequences they faced. As Ryland immerses himself in the Iridian's world, he becomes increasingly aware of the magnitude of their existence and the profound implications of their knowledge. The fate of not only Earth but potentially countless other civilizations rests on his shoulders as he endeavors to unlock the secrets of the Iridian's technology and harness the power of KELT 22b. Part 3 concludes with Ryland making significant progress in understanding the Iridian's methodology and preparing to implement their plan. Armed with newfound knowledge and the weight of the Iridian's legacy, he sets his sights on returning to Earth with the hope of using KELT 22b as the ultimate weapon to save humanity from the clutches of the astrophage. Part 3 delves into the awe inspiring realm of the Iridians and their advanced technology, while Ryland Grace embarks on a quest to decipher their secrets. Andy Wehr skillfully weaves together elements of ancient civilizations, scientific exploration, and the determination to find salvation in the face of an existential threat, immersing readers in a thrilling and intellectually stimulating narrative. Part 4, The Way Things Were In Part 4 of Project Hail Mary, titled The Way Things Were, the narrative alternates between Ryland Grace's present-day mission and flashbacks to events on Earth. These flashbacks provide insight into the desperate situation humanity faced as the astrophage crisis escalated and shed light on Ryland's relationships with his former colleague, Eva Strat, and his mentor, Dr. Shara Kapoor. As Ryland continues his work aboard the Hail Mary, memories from his life on Earth resurface, taking readers on a journey through the tumultuous events leading up to the mission. These recollections highlight the tireless efforts of scientists and governments around the world to combat the astrophage threat. Ryland's memories reveal the inception of Project Hail Mary, the global initiative to find a solution to the astrophage crisis. He recalls the initial stages of the project, the recruitment of talented individuals from various scientific disciplines, and the formation of teams dedicated to research and brainstorming potential strategies. Among the key figures in Ryland's memories is Eva Strat, a brilliant scientist and his former colleague. Their professional collaboration evolves into a deep personal connection, with moments of camaraderie and shared determination to save humanity. The flashbacks provide glimpses into their relationship, which is marked by both professional respect and unresolved tensions. Another influential figure in Ryland's memories is Dr. Shara Kapoor, his mentor and a renowned astrophysicist. 
Dr. Kapoor's wisdom and guidance shaped Ryland's scientific career and instilled in him a profound appreciation for the wonders of the universe. Through the flashbacks, readers witnessed the profound impact Dr. Kapoor had on Ryland's life and the lasting legacy she left behind. The flashbacks also delve into the complex dynamics between nations and the challenges of international cooperation in the face of a global crisis. As governments grapple with the impending doom, tensions arise, and conflicts emerge, highlighting the fragile balance between collaboration and self-interest. These recollections provide a glimpse into the collective efforts of scientists, politicians, and citizens across the globe. They underscore the magnitude of the astrophage threat and the sense of urgency that pervaded society as the world teetered on the brink of extinction. Amidst the flashbacks, Ryland's present-day mission aboard the Hail Mary continues. He faces numerous obstacles, both technical and personal, as he grapples with the weight of his responsibilities. The memories serve as a reminder of the stakes involved and fuel his determination to succeed. Part 4 weaves together the past and the present, offering a comprehensive view of the events leading up to the mission and the challenges faced by humanity. It explores the human aspect of the crisis, delving into the complexities of relationships and the sacrifices made in the pursuit of a common goal. Andy Weir masterfully combines the personal and the global, immersing readers in a tapestry of emotions and highlighting the resilience of the human spirit in the face of overwhelming adversity. Part 5, The Way Things End In Part 5 of Project Hail Mary, titled The Way Things End, the narrative reaches its climactic conclusion as Ryland Grace and his companions face their final challenges in their race against time to save Earth from the devastating astrophage. Ryland's journey takes an unexpected turn as he discovers that the dormant Iridians aboard the Hail Mary possess a collective consciousness. Through a neural link, he is granted access to their knowledge and memories, enabling him to tap into their wisdom and unravel the mysteries of the universe. Guided by the Iridians' collective consciousness, Ryland gains profound insights into the nature of the astrophage and the intricacies of KLT-22b, the gas giant that holds the key to Earth's salvation. He refines his understanding of the Iridians' failed attempts to harness the planet's power and devises a new plan to utilize its energy on an unprecedented scale. As Ryland's understanding deepens, he is confronted with the ethical implications of his actions. He grapples with the consequences of manipulating an entire planet, potentially sacrificing the lives and ecosystems within it to save humanity. These moral dilemmas challenge his resolve and force him to confront the limits of his own humanity. Meanwhile, the crew of the Hail Mary faces increasing hardships as they navigate the hazards of space and the diminishing resources aboard the ship. Tensions rise, relationships strain, and the specter of sacrifice looms over them all. Each member of the crew must grapple with their own personal demons and make difficult choices in the face of seemingly insurmountable odds. Throughout Part 5, the narrative intensifies with heart-stopping action sequences and high-stakes decision-making. The crew of the Hail Mary must overcome formidable obstacles, both within and outside the ship, as they execute Ryland's audacious plan to harness the power of KLT-22B and neutralize the astrophage. As the climax unfolds, the fate of Earth hangs in the balance. The crew's bravery and determination are put to the ultimate test, as they confront the full extent of the astrophage's destructive capabilities. Sacrifices are made, alliances are forged, and unforeseen revelations shake the very foundation of their understanding. In the midst of this chaos, Ryland Grace emerges as the linchpin of the mission, drawing upon his resilience, intellect, and sheer willpower to navigate the treacherous path to victory. His character is tested, his resolve is pushed to its limits, and his ultimate purpose is revealed as he grapples with the weight of the lives entrusted to his care. Part 5 culminates in a thrilling and emotionally charged finale, where the fate of humanity is decided in a grand showdown with the astrophage. The sacrifices made, the choices confronted, and the triumphs achieved leave readers on the edge of their seats, gripped by the profound implications of the mission's outcome.
Part 5 concludes the narrative arc of Project Hail Mary with an exhilarating and satisfying resolution. Andy Weir masterfully weaves together elements of science, ethics, and human resilience to deliver a conclusion that leaves readers both breathless and contemplative. The journey undertaken by Ryland Grace and his companion serves as a testament to the indomitable spirit of humanity in the face of overwhelming challenges. Epilogue a new beginning the epilogue of Project Hail Mary offers readers a glimpse into the aftermath of the mission and the long-term impact of Ryland Grace's efforts to save Earth from the astrophage. It explores the transformative effects of the mission on both a personal and global scale, revealing the resilience of humanity and the boundless possibilities for the future. Following the successful neutralization of the astrophage, Earth begins the arduous process of recovery. The world unites in celebration, honoring the heroic efforts of Ryland Grace, the crew of the Hail Mary, and the countless scientists and individuals who contributed to the mission's success. A newfound sense of unity and collective purpose emerges, as humanity realizes the importance of collaboration and the fragility of their existence. Ryland, now hailed as a global hero, grapples with the weight of his newfound fame and the impact of his actions. Despite his pivotal role in saving humanity, he remains humble and grounded, recognizing the collaborative nature of the mission and the contributions of his fellow crew members. He finds solace in the knowledge that the sacrifices made were not in vain, and that Earth now has a chance at a brighter future. In the wake of the mission's success, scientific advancements and exploration reach unprecedented heights. The discoveries made during the Hail Mary mission serve as a catalyst for a new era of exploration, both within our solar system and beyond. The collective knowledge gained from studying the Iridian's technology and KLT-22B opens doors to new frontiers and sparks a renaissance in scientific understanding. Space agencies around the world embark on ambitious missions, venturing deeper into the cosmos in search of habitable exoplanets and signs of extraterrestrial life. The Hail Mary mission serves as an inspiration for future generations of scientists and explorers, igniting a renewed sense of wonder and curiosity about the universe and our place within it. On a personal level, Ryland continues to grapple with the impact of his experiences aboard the Hail Mary. He finds solace in reconnecting with his loved ones, including his former colleague Eva Strat. Their relationship deepens as they navigate the aftermath of the mission together, forging a bond built on shared hardship, understanding, and a common purpose. The epilogue also offers glimpses into the lives of the other crew members, showcasing their individual journeys of healing and growth. They each find their own paths, using their unique skills and experiences to contribute to the post-astrophage world in meaningful ways. Their shared history aboard the Hail Mary forms an unbreakable bond, and they remain connected through the memories and challenges they face together. As the epilogue concludes, readers are left with a sense of hope and possibility. The Hail Mary mission has not only saved Earth from the brink of extinction but also rekindled the indomitable spirit of humanity. The story of Ryland Grace and his companion serves as a testament to the resilience and adaptability of our species, reminding us that even in the face of insurmountable odds, there is always the potential for a new beginning. The epilogue of Project Hail Mary is a poignant reflection on the transformative power of collective action, scientific exploration, and the enduring spirit of humanity. It leaves readers with a sense of optimism for the future a reminder that our capacity to overcome challenges and strive for greatness knows no bounds.